So we want to congratulate to Mrs. Mary and Mr. Zach Elliott from my understanding of billions, trillions, perhaps 40 billion years and 13 billion dimensions that they have destroyed for my universe and universes. So that is a hint to why those medications came out. The CFU pretty much see fuck you and kill you and all the rest of the dimensions and planets that were connected and involved in this very event. Meaning the stompings, the killings, the hits, the threats to vote for this woman with someone else's divine partner in someone else's face. So majority votes, majority wins, and they won six dimension wedding. These couples that were here passed after wedded to their divine partner, meaning I don't have a face anymore, do I? And I haven't in a very long time. To walk around as Mrs. or Miss Universe love element. Do I? Obviously I don't. And the very reason is because someone wed someone in my face, isn't it? Anyways, there will be zero comeback from this. Meaning, there won't be Zach back for me ever again. Because it costed... This much pain and sufferings and infinite life, infinite dreams for a bunch of people that were affected upon love universe and a bunch of places such as dimensions. That is why it is impossible to come back for some, from some shit like this. Do you understand how much pain and sufferings it caused? And then the sign, the treaty, the whatever else for me and John, the killing, the... the Beyond not acceptable of memory race and everything else to have some sort of gay lesbian stuff and accuse people of being gay and lesbian in the past. So we don't like that. Do you understand? We don't like that. So when someone weds in sixth dimension, they pass a great life and great dreams for eternity. They only wed the person that is created for them that they have passed with from all these different dimensions. Do you understand? So someone wore my face from I don't know what dimension or how long. Obviously, it got to 60. It passed as me. They supposedly have 30 children already. And perhaps revows and revows over revows. Adam and Eve were born in the fourth dimension and would go to ever after as the time and education goes on. So they'll reach fifth dimensional dimension and so on. They were granted and given the rights and freedom at fourth dimension to wed and prosper to the very next dimension. And so on to wherever else. When reaching this dimension, there's no comeback to the person and or the person that they left behind to wed someone else. Zero. As the passings, similar to education, any part of life, the passings must be proper and real. So to sign someone went into my face and my supposed divine partner, it must be logical that someone knows that it was the right person, right? So maybe I'm in a fraudulent body, a fraudulent soul, a fraudulent feeling body. Do you understand? So my wedding with John was fucked up for what? Prosecuted for what? We would love to fucking know. A mistake here, for example, my wedding with John in the fourth dimension made me had to live in three dimensional areas for a span of 30 
years. Fourth Dimension has more shadows and looks more real and powers and capabilities of objects, planets, and animals seem to speak. I am in Fourth Dimension alone since 2020. With animals and trees and plants, even statues that speak. Activities such as false crimes and claims will result in punishment and the unknown, obviously, are reprimandments. Because we don't fucking know what happened before 1988, do we? So the reprimandments are really unknown, isn't it? Such as vicious murders of Jane and John and the rest of the people that were captive and held captive for stupid accusations such as plants and drugs and medication, things like that. Including mental illness that causes gay, lesbians, and whatever else. Which is criminal activities because we would love to fucking know. Praise fucking children, everything else. So I do wonder why these suppose given partner... Is not... With the given partner. I would love to know. The reason why people get memory erased. We would love to know as well. Because it obviously shows a sign. That someone is committing a crime. And memory erasing people. If people do not remember. How do people and life succeed? As the planets must orbit. On an invisible orbiter, surely, as life and planets do and patterns do, of patterns of life, if you erase memory, the same patterns will happen in a person's life. When you down age someone to a kid's age, do you understand? And if it stays put, then obviously it's like a flat surface in the universe, a piece of land that doesn't move. Meaning as they are laying to rest in peace somewhere. It's the end. The bottom ever after constant trance. Trees and dreams and life and everything else. As a result in voting. Surely it really meant. They were meant to be together forever. The proper divine partner. In every chemi chemistry way. Soul, body, every single thing without forgery, copying, mending and molding, or any nonsense of that sort. So, Zach came back to me, Jane Monica, not kissable nor wettable in 2005 after a kissable incident. Seemingly, when he went missing, he had wed and never came back. So just maybe the rumors were real and they did end up with 30 children of their own as I played down believing in good of all life still. The memory race and threats and harm really meant not much as the lessons learning in this path of life. Surely I seek to congratulate them and seek to move forward in my journey of life.